What's up everybody, Dazed here, back with another Dragon Ball Z Universe 2 video. And today, we're going to continue on with our Expert Mission series, and I'm going to show you how to be Expert Mission 11. Now, as always, we're going to be doing this offline. No help from anybody, just the computer to help us. In this one, you're going to be fighting Omega Shenron, and this one is a little different than the other ones have been. Uh, some things have changed. Uh, you're going to get Super Electric Strike from this, so if you're trying to get that move, this is the mission to get it from, so watch to the end so you can see exactly how to get this done. Now, just like the other expert missions I've done, I'm going to be using my Male Earthling Balance build on this. If you're curious as to what that is, I'll leave a suggested video at the top right here. Uh, I think you should check it out. It's a really fun build to use. So, right off the bat, you want to have ultimate charge, max charge, and start charging. If you got ultimate charge, you're going to be able to get 5 bars of key before the enemy even gets out. So, start charging right off the bat, and then continue to charge up. But go after the computer, you charge up, and then use whatever Awoken so you got. I'm using Potential Unleashed. And then we're just going to start hitting him with Emperor's Death Beams. Now, right off the bat, he's throwing out them blue orbs. And luckily I was in a good spot and I didn't get hit by any of them. So we're going to keep charging up. He likes to use this move a lot too. He's going to knock me away. But we're just going to keep coming at him with some Emperor's Death Beams. And, and draining that energy because he's got a lot of health. And for some reason uh, you're kind of nerfed on your damage. So you want to get that done. Now you'll notice right there I cannot punch him. This is a new thing so far in the expert missions I believe. You cannot punch him, it's just like Goku's Ultra Instinct, you have to hit him with Key Blast. He's gonna knock us through a portal, and now we're gonna have to fight some other people and get back through another portal. Now this part of the expert mission could be really annoying. Uh, it's gonna happen like, I think like four times, three, four times in this one, so be prepared. You're gonna be getting knocked through them portals once you get his health down so far. In this one, we're gonna be fighting Super 17. Uh, not too bad. Uh, we, we take him out pretty easily. And then we're going to get right back through the portal so we can start getting back on Omega Shenron. If you're low on key or stamina, this is where you want to replenish that. Charge up right now if your key is low or break your stamina so you can regain it all. And then go back through the portal so you can continue to fight Omega Shenron. Now we're going to go out. We're going to forget that he dodges everything. And he's going to throw out them blue orbs again. For some reason, I start blocking. Uh... You will get broken if they hit you. Luckily, we just hit him with some Emperor's Death Beam, so he's not going to come and attack us, and we're going to get our stamina back with no problem. And we're just going to keep doing that. We're going to keep charging up, and we're going to hit him with them Emperor's Death Beams. It's going to take a while. He's going to throw out these blue orbs all the time, too, so be ready for that. And now he's going to knock us back through the portal again. Now, I don't know how these work, if it's based on which portal you're closest to or not, but we get knocked back through the same portal and fight Super 17 again. Now, Ice and Nova Shenron are both in this, but we don't see all three of them. So, we're going to come right back through, and it's right back on Omega Shenron again. Just keep just keep chipping away at his health. It's going to take a while, because he doesn't take that much damage. And he's got to knock us back through once again. Like I said, this happens a bunch of times. It's really annoying to deal with, but... Once you get that move unlocked, you never have to come back and do this expert mission again. There's no reason to. So this time, though, we are... Oh, no, it's Super 17 again. Never mind. So, beat him again, right back through the portal. Right back up, oh, and I forgot. Uh, your CPUs will be getting hit through these two, and you're going to have to come over to the portals and break them stones off of it. I hadn't been doing that the whole time, so I don't know if a bunch of them have been trapped there for a while now. So don't forget to look around at the portals and break any of those off so that you can get your health back. So we're right back over and we're fighting him again and he's going to knock us back through another time. Now this time we're actually going to fight somebody different. It can be pretty annoying when you just keep going back to fight the same person. At least this time they switch it up for us and we are going to be fighting Ice Shenron now, which is nice. It's nice to switch it up because it, it does get monotonous just doing the same thing over and over and over. But we're going to take him out. It's no problem. It's pretty simple. They're always pretty simple. 
and we're going to go right back through, and it's it's right back to chipping away at his health. I believe now we're at the point where we are taking a little bit more out. He's back with them blue orbs. He, he just throws them out so many times in this one. We're going to help out the CPU and get them back out. We want that distraction so that we don't get attacked. And then it's right back over to, to keep hitting him with the Emperor's Death Beams. And, you know, it, it, it's pretty boring but this is the the best way to do it so now you can see we've got his health all the way down we're gonna finish it up takes a long time but you get super electric strike unlocked now I don't believe it'll tell you during the mission that you've got it unlocked you're only gonna find out right here at the end if you've unlocked it so you're not gonna know until you finish the whole mission I might be wrong on that but as far as I can remember that's how it worked we're going to get a little bit of TP medals, uh, nothing too big. And that's that's it. That's that's the whole mission. So hopefully this helped you out. And you come back for more because I will be dropping all of the expert missions. Uh, more character creations and character builds will be coming soon. So look for them. And uh, if you have any suggestions, put them down in the comments below and I'll try and help you out with it. As always, if you like the content I am putting out, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.